that you're out there, you're really a, an arm twister, that you're really bludgeoning. There's never threats. There's never intimidation. It just doesn't happen. In most states, you could go to the attorney general to take on uh, who's ever politically pressuring you. In Illinois, those solutions aren't really available to, to well-meaning bureaucrats. The attorney general of the state of Illinois is uh, Lisa Madigan, who's the daughter of the Speaker of the House. The state's attorney general, Lisa Madigan, the all-powerful House Speaker's daughter. I promise you, it is with humility, purpose, and enthusiasm that I embark on my fourth term. There's nothing wrong with Lisa Madigan being attorney general of the state of Illinois, except that she can't divorce herself, I don't believe, from being a, the daughter of the speaker. She's capable, but anyone who argues that she got to the attorney general's office on her own is telling fairy tales. I am enjoying my job as the attorney general right now, and when I am ready to make a decision, I will let all of you be among the first people to know. You know, there were a lot of rumors about Mike Madigan's daughter running for governor. She chose not to run. Some people speculated because she felt uncomfortable if her father remained speaker while she was governor of the state of Illinois. Lisa Madigan would be an excellent candidate for governor and has the ability to be elected governor, but can't really do that as long as he's in his position of power. Lisa Madigan might have won the governor's office but her father would not step down from his speakership to avoid the perception of conflict of interest. Lisa and I had spoken about that on several occasions, and she knew very well that I did not plan to retire. Maybe she expected her father would step aside, but nobody who knew him thought he would. This is his game. I think he's a little too addictive to power to step down for his daughter. Hopefully that will change uh, because she would make a good governor and it's not likely she can be elected governor as long as Mike Madigan is speaker.